Where do you find value reading autobiographies and biographies of great leaders? When I'm facing a challenge in my day-to-day -day work with uh, corporations on environmental issues or just broader you know, policy issues around environmental, uh, environmental conditions, you know, I don't have a chance to sit down with Gandhi and say, how would you solve this problem? <laughs> <laughs> you can't do that. Uh, so I'm able to have a, a one-way conversation at least and just draw inspiration from the, from the way that they solve problems. And so um, you know, lately I've been, uh, I think, feeling frustrated with, I think, a, a really, the level of discourse that's been disrespectful in the public, I mm -hmm. think, on all sides of all issues. I think there's a coarseness that's, that's happening. Um, uh, that's kind of upset me a little bit. Uh, you know, problem solving in that environment is, is very challenging. And so I can sit down and you know, read Gandhi's autobiography or read books about how he approached social problems and social justice and, and draw inspiration from that. So while I will never you know, be a person that is probably executing you know, Gandhi's uh, Satyagraha movement of nonviolent resistance to big social problems, I can draw insights and inspiration from what he did do, which was you know, uh, look, for, look for truth, holding mm -hmm. on to truth, mm -hmm. um, uh, holding on to the moral force of truth, uh, being respectful to your opponents, even if you don't agree with them. Yeah. Uh, having the, the concept of, and I don't know if I say this word right, but ahimsa, which is uh, basically uh, non-injury. So, uh, which, which means that even if I'm not, you know, I'm not a violent person, I'm not gonna punch someone in the nose if I, if I don't agree with them, but I can also restrict my words to saying, uh, you know, n that means not emotional violence too. Like I'm not going to attack someone personally or escalate conflict. Mm -hmm. um, uh, and those are really helpful because you don't solve conflict by adding more conflict. Mm -hmm. uh, that's something that you know, reading a biography from a famous person can, can teach me that I would not probably have come up with on my own. Yeah. So um, I find it incredibly valuable, uh, especially in times when I'm having a, a, a finding difficulty or finding frustration that someone out there can, can teach me a lesson uh, even if I don't know them.